Hi, welcome again. Now we are going to discuss about the difference and similarities between Abacus and Vedic Mathematics. This is from teacher's point of view. If you are planning to start your coaching business or classes and you are confused that what should I start? This is my small attempt to give you clarity about this. So first we are going to discuss about the difference between Abacus and Vedic Mathematics. Before, before we start first understand Abacus has its own charm, has its own style and Vedic Mathematics has its own style so actually we cannot compare abacus and vedic mathematics but there is a lot of confusion between abacus and vedic mathematics and that's why i'm creating this video so to learn how to calculate on abacus you require this tool abacus tool and for vedic mathematics you do not require any tool abacus is completely a brain gym tool where major focus is on brain development and Vedic mathematics is major focus on mathematics, solving complicated mathematical calculations in short time. The age group for Abacus is 5 years or 4 years to 12 to 13 years old kids and Vedic mathematics age group is above 10 years or 12 years. Anyone can, anyone can practice Vedic, Vedic mathematics above 12 or 10, 10 or 12 years old. Anyone who is planning for competitive exams, they can also go for Vedic Mathematics. And Abacus is more into the brain development. To learn Abacus, you don't need to know the whole mathematical calculations. You just need to understand, you just need to know the basic numbers, 1 to 9 numbers. Even if child doesn't know about addition and subtraction, on Abacus, they can start understanding, they can start learning addition and subtraction. In Vedic Mathematics, where higher calculations are involved, then Vedic Mathematics is very helpful. So Abacus is totally different and Vedic Mathematics is different. So I will request do not compare it or do not mix it because Abacus itself is very vast and more than that Vedic Mathematics is very vast. As a teacher, you can structurize Abacus curriculum, Abacus syllabus. As a teacher, it is bit difficult to structureize Vedic Mathematics syllabus because it is very vast. We have referred many different books and libraries for Vedic Mathematics. So it requires a lot of practice. So Abacus is different and Vedic Mathematics is different. These are the differences, basic differences. Now what are the similarities? Both techniques, Abacus and Vedic Mathematics helps you to save calculation time. Abacus and Vedic Mathematics help you to increase your calculation speed. It helps in boosting concentration. When you play with number, automatically your brain starts concentrating. It improves your concentration. And when you're comfortable with numbers or calculations, when you're good at calculations, automatically it helps to increase your confidence, it boosts your confidence. So these are the similarities between Abacus and Vedic Mathematics. The core and the base is mathematics and it helps in brain development. Abacus and Vedic Mathematics as well both helps in your brain development focus. It saves your time, gives you confidence. So now if you're a teacher and you're confused, what should I start now? Vedic Mathematics and or Abacus. So I'll give you one simple tip here. Here you can consider your experience if you have. If you are confident with mathematics or you have experience as a, if you are already maths teacher, you have experience in dealing with mathematics uh, uh, on a regular basis. So you can go for both at a time. But if you are starting and you are confused, you have to check yourself with whom you are comfortable. What age group you can handle very well? Are you comfortable with small kids, 4 to 12, 13 years old kids? Are you comfortable with them? Can you handle small kids very well? If yes, then go for Abacus. If you are not comfortable or if you are not confident enough to handle small kids, then you can start with Vedic Mathematics where you will have to deal with the kids above 12 years. This is, this is first criteria. If you are okay to run codes for two to three years period, if you are uh, ready for that, then you can go for a backers. If you want courses for a short time, for six months, three months or maximum for one year, then you can go for Vedic Mathematics. Based on this criteria, you can decide and yes, if you are planning to start any one of these, we can help you in this. You can contact us. And you can check details in description. And let me know if this, if this is really helpful for you. This is Shubhada Bhavi, teacher, trainer, entrepreneur and parent. Thank you so much.